Welcome back to Jibber Jab Reviews, guys, and I hope you all have been enjoying your weekend thus far, and you're ready to pick up four more beauties from two different developers in our top free watch faces of the week. And these have promos attached to them with some ending in only a few days, so make sure you download them as soon as you can, and don't forget that to help you guys out, I always leave the direct links to all the faces I review right in the video description. And I tried to include a good mix of different designs and styles in this review, so hopefully Hopefully there's at least a couple that appeal to you guys, but let me know which ones were your favorites anyways. And by the way, I will be in San Jose next week for the Samsung Developer Conference, so make sure you follow me on Instagram as I'm going to be providing updates about the events, some developer spotlights, plus maybe even a few surprises like coupon giveaways, so you guys will definitely want to stay tuned for that. Okay, enough of my jibber jab, let's go check out this week's top free picks. All right, guys, the first two faces are from Broda, and these are going to be available for free until the 31st, so really you only have a few more days to grab these. Now, the face that I'm showing you here is a hybrid watch face that's set in this very modern design, and it has this sweeping seconds dial on the right-hand side, which definitely adds a nice accent for this layout. And this one also includes four areas that you can personalize. First, if you tap near the five and the seven positions, well, you can change the colors of the hour and the minute hands, and there's 13 different themes that you can choose from here. Then if you tap in between the 10 and 11 position, you can change the colors of the frame there around the center and that X shape pattern, and that also affects the markers around the bezel. Tapping in between the one and the two positions changes your background colors, and again, you also have 13 themes to choose from here. Now for features, the rest of the information falls into one of the areas around that X frame, including a few right in the center box area. Starting from the top, you have a power remaining indicator, the date and a weekday counter is to the left, a step counter and goal is at the bottom, and of course your digital time is located there on the right hand side. This one also comes with five customizable app shortcuts, as well as one that's fixed to your S Health. Okay, next up is the Outpost 3, and I love this design. It's kind of a mix of old and new styles. It has a great textured background, and again, that sweeping seconds hand on the right-hand side returns, which looks great with this circular layout. Now, customizations for this face revolve around theme changes for that circular background, as well as the outer ring around the bezel. And to cycle through those, you just need to double tap in the center of the face. You can also change the color of the minute band, and that can also be done with a quick double tap right on the right hand side. And for features on this one, well, you have the date and a moon phase above. Your power remaining and step goal is shown on the left hand side, along with those interactive bubbles that activate or disappear depending on the current measurement. And then in the bottom area, you have your heart rate as well as your total steps count. And I really like the different theme combinations on this one, especially for those minute digits because they add a really nice contrast against the other background themes. And lastly, this one comes with two fixed app shortcuts to your heart rate and S health apps, and the other four shortcuts are customizable. All right, the next two faces are from Vienna Studios, and any time you can grab these for free is great, because if you're familiar with this developer, then I don't need to remind you how expensive some of the faces in this collection are. Now this first one is a hybrid face again, which is set in a modern design and would tap access to changing the themes for the LCD panel at the top, as well as the background colors for the rest of the display. And to change either of these areas is really simple as you only need a single tap, either in that LCD panel or on the color gauge indicator, which is shown there at the bottom left of the face. And as you cycle through the colors in both of these areas, you can see the indicator also shifts to show your current color selection, as well as the next one coming up. And for features, you have the digital time and date above. You have a battery power indicator next to that gas icon on the left hand side. And on the right hand side, you have your total steps count, your calories burnt, as well as your heart rate. And finally, this one comes preset with four app shortcuts to your weather, phone, 
calendar and fitness apps. Okay, and the last one that I want to share with you is this hybrid face, which is detailed and I would even say mesmerizing because you have some gyro motion effects built into that ring around the bezel, whereby the colors and the lines shift when you move the watch back and forth. Now on this model, you have three separate areas for theme variations. A double tap on the small month dial at the bottom changes those colors. Tapping on the date display area at the bottom right changes the ring colors around the bezel. And then tapping right in the center of the face changes the colors for those two larger dials. And within those dials, you have your last recorded heart rate, your step count, as well as your step progress shown on the left. And on the right hand side in that dial, that identifies your power remaining, both as an analog indicator as well as a percentage. And for app shortcuts, well, they're represented along the bezel in the top half of the face for your S Health, your music player, your weather, phone, calendar, and contact apps. All right, guys, that's a recap of these four faces that you can now pick up for free. Just remember that these are on promos right now, so don't delay in getting a copy if you really do like them. And as a reminder, remember to follow us on Instagram, as I'm going to be in San Jose next week for the Samsung Developer Conference, and I will be providing you guys with updates as well as freebies in the form of coupons, so you may even be able to grab some more goodies there if you're quick. Thanks again for watching the review. Enjoy the rest of your weekend, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Until then, take care. Thanks again for watching our review and if you liked it then show us some love with a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and share the video with your friends because with your support it really helps me keep the channel going so I can continue to offer you guys discounts, giveaways and of course fresh content. I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, take care.